Our top story at 10. Hundreds of students of West Monroe High School are out sick this week due to flu-like symptoms. NBC 10's Hunter Elise back from the school and has more on what school officials and students have to say about that outbreak. Hunter. Bodie and Michelle, as of this afternoon, over 500 kids and a few teachers have gone home due to the flu or strep throat. The school principal is trying to make the message clear to parents that if your child shows any symptoms, please keep your child at home. It was like a plague. Hundreds out sick at one of Northeast Louisiana's largest high schools. Well, the first word we got was, uh, believe it or not, was Friday night uh, when our band could not march uh, because our band directors alerted us that they had 20, about 25 members of their band out. Since last Friday, over 500 students have gone home. West Monroe High even had to bring in another nurse to help their own school nurse deal with the amount of students who've been showing signs of the flu. It was a lot of people towards the end of the day, like, getting checked out, and you can see, like, everybody today, they had masks on their face. With so many people out sick, it has one student worried about the amount of schoolwork everyone's missing. For people to not be at school while school is still in session and missing things, that's not fair for them to be sick, and it's not fair for the school to keep going while, while, with everybody sick as much as they are. On Tuesday alone, another 140 kids were sent home early. School officials say everyone is getting sick due to being in confined spaces in the halls or classroom, causing germs to spread quickly. If your child wakes up in the morning, uh, overall body aches, headaches, uh, fever, please don't send them to school. Uh, keeping them home uh, will only help school get back to normal in a few days. After school today, the school cleaned every classroom and door handle to try and keep the rest of the school safe from catching anything. As of now, school will not be closing this week and classes will resume as usual. In the studio, Hunter Elise, NBC10, your local news leader.